Today Purism just released the final specs of the upcoming Libra M5 phone. In other news, I've added a new commit to my P2P FPS named Daxi, whose development never seemed to complete, the game is not even playable by now. So I thought, why not demo both together? First, let's look at the Libra M5's hardware specifications. The phone features a 1.5 GHz quad-core ARM, an OpenGL3 capable GPU, 3 GB of memory, HD screen and Ooh combo jack, I hate it. Anyway, I've already got the camu image. Let's create the virtual machine. Um, let's check if this matches the specs. No shit this is the new King Cross Terminal. Looks lots simpler than GNOME's default. What does this button do? Nothing. Okay then. Is pip installed? No. I love how the title bar turns red as administrative privilege is used, even within sudo. They fixed the keyboard layout. It used to be a lot stranger. What? Setup tools is missing? Fine. This time it better be working. Oops, I forgot to install GLFW. Axi only runs at 640 by 480 pixels by default. 
This means the scaling of factor 2 is also applied to OpenGL or just GLFW. Not cool. Also notice how Fosh take total control of the cursor, enable me to rotate the camera smoothly. Now Fosh doesn't give GLFW a proper window decoration. Looks like western, or something. Very laggy. Let's check the FPS. Oops, there ain't no git. You better git god. That's it. Not too bad, given it's running in a VM, and I have no idea how to turn on hardware acceleration. Finally, let's take a look at how Axi perform natively. Pretty smooth, huh? 